All right, welcome back to another vlog, and today's vlog, you know, is just kicking off with lunchtime. You know, before they start, you know, before they started the game, you know, I started to take a few shots, tried to take a few threes, and I, and I made a three pointer on my third try. Like I think it was like on that spot right there. I mean, I meant for like. I know. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know. I went for Zach's hammer. I went like all the way to the fucking side from where I was. Like, I would. Man, I weighed out that. Why did you say so? I don't know. Should have said something, Jalidin. <laughs> <laughs> You all right, Tim? <laughs> you, <laughs> I was about to say, you can do it. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, no. Uh, oh. Are you kidding me? Oh, boy. Oh, <laughs> that would have gone in. Darn. All right. Now we're heading out to acting. This is uh, this is the acting classroom. And now, time to get the stick. Uh, where's it? There it is. <laughs> Super Vance Clark Kent. Wait, hey, my chair. No. Matthew, get back here. Clark Kent is Spider-Man. We all know that. What kind of scream is that? Are you okay? I see. Black Widow dies. Whoa. Alright, so we just, uh, you know, finished off our senior project movie right here in the library, and now these guys are just gonna, you know, they're gonna about to leave. Oh! <laughs> And as you can see, there's uh, there's the uh, iPad that we filmed. Oh, thank you. See, there's me. Hello. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Uh, see, oh, this is paper. Okay. Um, and then uh, now I'm about to leave because uh, we got a the Casa Varsity baseball game is playing today, and uh, they're playing against Rancho Katati. So I'll be heading to the heading to the baseball field right now. So, I found a baseball, which was over there, and I thought, and I, and I thought maybe one of the baseball team lost, just, you know, had it over there, and there's JV, I don't know if that's JV or freshman baseball, but I'm just gonna give it back to them, you know, just to be safe if, if it really is theirs. Is this yours? Yeah. Okay. Alright, cool. Alright, this is the, uh, starting pitcher that will be pitching for today's game, and that's... Number 13, Jake McCoy. Ooh. I have to say, Jake is really good. Like, for real. 100%. Ooh. Atta boy. Ooh. So here we go. Jake McCoy is on the mound pitching. Right now there's one ball and two strikes. And, you know. We're just starting the top of the first inning. Good. Ooh. Hey, you all right, Colt? 
tips it foul. Ooh, a strikeout. Oh. Foul ball. Oh, God. And Nick, oh. All right, so. Leading off is Noah Bailey. Leading off a bat. Right now he has no balls and two strikes. And Ooh. And there's ball one. And he got the good eye there. So now it's two balls and two strikes. Oh. Ooh. Three balls and two strikes. Getting ready. Oh, man. Wow, that's a base hit. Base hit for Noah Bailey. All right, so Nick Tormina batted second, and he just made a base hit as well. So now we got two men on base, Noah Bailey on second, and Nick Tormina on first. And now right here, right now batting, batting third, is Joe Lampy. Yeah, oh. Oh. oh my. There you go. Two balls and one strike. Here we go. Oh. Oh man. There's strike two. Okay. Well, there's a pop up and. Oh! Foul ball. Went way over there. Here we go. Three balls, two strikes. Ball four. Bases are loaded. Cole Santander batting fourth on the lineup. You know, cleaning up the spot. Right now, there's no balls and two strikes. And of course, bases are loaded. No outs. Oh, God. There's a foul ball. Oh. This will work. Well, there's one out, but here comes Noah Bailey. And everyone is safe. Cole Santander will get an RBI. So now it's one nothing Gauchos. All right, Elijah Waltz batting fifth in the lineup. Right now, two balls and two strikes. Oh. All right, three, two. Three balls, two strikes. Foul ball, all look out. The foul ball went above the visitor's dugout. Oh, another foul ball. And there's ball four. Bases are loaded again. And now batting in the sixth spot is, whoa. Whoa, he just got striked out, but. Now batting for the Gauchos, first baseman number 44, And now. It's two balls and two strikes now. Oh, holy smokes. Ah. 
That's three outs. Cole Shimmick is batting eighth. It's oh god. Wait, where's the ball? And foul ball. Oh, I heard it over there. Uh, Cole Shimmick. It's a uh, top of this. I mean, whoops, bottom of the second, and it's uh, still one nothing Gauchos. And uh, Cole Shimmick just walked. And now we get Con Connor Clemenock in the last spot of the lineup. And uh, by the way, Cole, Shim Cole Shimmick is the uh, designated hitter for today. And whoa! Look out! Alright, Cole, uh, Cole's safe. He bunts. Oh, he gets it. He gets his speed. Yeah! All right. Woohoo! That Connor Clemenock gets the speed. He's safe at first by using the bunt. And now we're back on top of the order. Noah Bailey is back in the. Is back batting in the batter's box. And it's uh, two balls, two strikes. Three balls, two strikes. Nobody out. Sorry. <laughs> My mistake. Oops. Whoa. Ball four. Bases are loaded. All right. Cole Shimmick scores. Nick Tormina gets an RBI. It's now 2 nothing Gauchos. Nick was bat at the batter's box, and now we get Joe Lampy back on the batter's box. Oh, time. Drop it, drop it. It's off the wall. Joe Lampy gets a double, and we get two people score. And we get two people score, and that's, oh, three people? Oh, I guess, I guess Joe Lampy gets a triple. Joe Lampy gets a triple. Noah Bailey scores. Connor Clemenock scores, and Nick Tormina scores. Joe Lampy gets three RBIs, I guess, for today, and it's five nothing Gauchos. And now we get Cole Santander back on the batter's box. And not only that, there's a there's a new pitcher for Rancho. It's another right-hander. Here we go. Two balls, no strikes. Oh, God. That's way high. It's caught. I see Joe Lampy scoring. Joe Lampy gets, I mean, Cole Santander gets another RBI. And now it's 6-0 Gauchos. There goes Elijah Waltz. He just got a base hit. Went back to the batter's box and now up to first base. And uh, now we get Nick Arella back on the batter's box. Oh! Look out! Oh! So now it's two outs and Elijah is at second base now. So there's a pitch hitter coming. That's Jake McCoy! And Jake McCoy gets a base hit and a, gets a base hit in an RBI! How about that? And as you see, Austin Matos has scored. Austin Matos pitched one for Elijah Waltz because uh, when Elijah was at bat, he got hit in the shin guard. And not only that, there's another pitch runner. He's right there at second base. That I, or wait, second? Yeah, Kyle Taylor. He got hit in the back. Or oh, actually, yeah, Kyle is in, on second base right now. No, nobody's pitch running for Kyle. So, but. He did get hit. And then we get Connor Clemenock back on the uh, batter's box. And, and right now it's 11 to nothing, Gauchos. And we're at the bottom of the third. Oh my god. And, aw, oh, three outs. All right, so now we got some defensive changes. Right now, right now on the mound, pitching is number 21, Max Schmedhammer. 
And not only that, there's more substitutions. Julian Centino is playing second now, subbing in for Nick Orella. Kobe Nark, number 27, is playing center field, subbing in for Noah Bailey. And Austin, Austin Maddow subbing in for Elijah Walton left field. And then we got the catcher. Isaac Sheeks. Sheeks? Okay, thank you. Isaac Sheeks is now catching, subbing in for Cole Santander. Kyle Taylor Oh, uh, I got it, I got it, I got it. No, never mind. <laughs> Nick Tormina, Joe Lampy, and Kyle Taylor and Connor Klemenak are still on the field. Left hat backed. When he's right here on the dugout. Rancho's been getting two man on base now. Alright, now we got pitch hitter right now. It's Patrick Sharp, number 19. And we had number six Russ Davis pitch it too, but he got grounded out by third. First debut of the season. And Patrick Sharp, this is his very first bat appearance on the batter's box. Hit it ball! Oh! Oh, hey, come, foul baby. ball, foul Great ball, job. foul ball right there. <laughs> foul ball, foul ball. Foul ball. <laughs> yeah, have, have them catch the home run. Have the team catch the home run. Hey. Ah. Great contact! Way, way down there. It's looking good. It's looking good so far. Watch the off speed, North. Come on, Patrick. And. Oh! Hey, hey, swings in a park! Three pitches, three swings. And now we got Max Medhammer uh, on the batter's box <coughs> on the bottom of the fifth. What a score! What a score! With a score of 11 to 4. Aww. Once again, 11 to 4, Gauchos. And we're about to start sixth inning. So, right now, it's bottom of the six, and right now, batting, as you see, is Isaac Sheiks. Isaac Sheiks just batted, and he just got a pop up. Right now there's two men on base, uh, and right now it's 12 to 4 Casa. Uh, Joe uh, Joe Lampy got an RBI with a double, so Joe Lampy's right over there by second base. And there's Kobe in third. Isaac Sheets got a pop up. There's two outs now, and we got we got Austin Matos, number 17, back in the batter's box. And we got, and we got Julian on deck just in case. Two balls and one strike. There's two outs out. Ball game, baby! Austin Matos gets two RBIs. Ball game, 
That's it. That's the ball game. Well, it's a ten run rule after five. Ten. Ten run rule. Woohoo! All right. Austin Maddows walks it off. Ten rule. Mercy rule. That's the that's the ball game. Casa Grande wins with the final score of 14 to 4. Oh, that was awesome. We're here in the Sims room and just, you know, we're going to work on some English stuff. And, uh, ready for English, Michael? No. Okay. Well, too bad. We're working it anyway, so gotta go. Alright, so now I'm back in the football field because the boys and the girls varsity lacrosse team, Casa Grande boys and girls varsity lacrosse team are having their playoff game right now. So pretty much uh, right here at this here at the field, the girls the girls varsity team are playing right now. They're taking on against Cardinal Newman. So four teams are in this are in this tournament are in the tournament round. So um, right now, uh, Casa Grande girls are playing uh, Cardinal Newman, and then later tonight at seven, the boys will be taking on Rancho Catati on their tournament. So um, yeah, so let's get that semis final win right now. Uh, the girls. The girl, the Casa Grande girls varsity are in the lead, in the lead of six to two. We're in the first half, and we only have like eleven minutes left. So, you know, let's get that win because Casa Grande's number one, baby. Go Gauchos! It's eight to five, Casa. We're we're only at, we're in the first half, and there's like thirty Slow seconds down, left. Slow it down. And right now, Carter Newman has the ball. Ten seconds left. Oh, right. okay. Cardinal New just can't score in these last ten seconds. Kale, get that ball back. Cardinal New. Oh. You got it, Kale. <laughs> All right, time's up. That's the first half. The girls, okay. the Casa Grande four, girls four, varsity, four, four, are advancing the championship. They just won the game with a score of twelve to seven. And now, the boys varsity are here. The gang's in the house. They're again. They're getting ready for Rancho. You ready for Rancho, Jack? Yes. <laughs> All right. All right, so since the girls is done, now we get the boys. They're here tonight for their, play for their tournament playoff game. All right, we got 20 seconds left in the first quarter for the boys varsity lacrosse game. The Gauchos are in the lead of four to nothing. And now we get 10 seconds left. Oh, oh, oh Lo Logan found me. Oh, okay. Ian McKissick. Oh, that's goal. That's, that went in. It's goal. That's goal. Yeah, it went in. Come on, it went in. It went in. I, I saw it. It went. Yeah. Yeah, Woo! five nothing. Let's go. End of first quarter. What a way to end the first quarter. All right, now we're like nearly 20 seconds left. It's second quarter, and now we got Gauchos in lead of 11 to nothing. Gauchos are on fire, beating Rancho big time. And they're hitting each other. Oh, time's up. There's the timer. The the guys, yeah, the guys are gonna huddle up for a bit to talk about what what they're gonna gonna do for the for the second half. Now we got 20 seconds left right here in the third quarter. Gauchos are right here on this side trying to shoot the, shoot another goal because uh, Casa in the big still in the big lead of 15 to nothing. There's Pierce Aldwell, and then there's a uh, oh boy, I see Jaden Bosarge. They are uh, the end of three. Gauchos 15, Rancho zero. End of third quarter. The last quarter right now. We're less than 50, line, less than 50 seconds left. Now we're up to 40, down to 40. I mean, and then we're almost down to 30. Right now, Casa Grande in the big lead, 17 
to one. The Casa Grande, once again, Casa Grande Gaucho 17, Barancho Cantati, Cougars one. But right now, Casa, they want to get another one before the time ends. So they can make it 18. Hold it, hold it, hold it. 10, Ten seconds. Roll it into the corner, roll it into the corner. Roll it into the corner. Four. Casa, advance the championship. Not only the girls varsity is going to the championship, but also the boys varsity is going to championship as well. How about that? Bring it in. Pretty much a winning day here. Winning day for yesterday and, and today. And hopefully the boys and girls lacrosse will win this Friday. And if they do, not only it'll be championship, not only they'll get the championship, but it's also this will also be a winning a winning week for Casa. So, hopefully this whole week will be awesome, and yeah, that's pretty much it. And uh, I'll see you in the next vlog. Peace.